Hi my creative friends, welcome back to my channel. This is Andrea. Now I wanted to take a moment today just to give you a quick little Cricut tutorial. This tutorial is based on a question that I got from my good friend Darlene who's a close to my heart maker and I figured if Darlene was asking this question then maybe many of you guys have the same question. It deals with project incompatibility errors when you go to actually make your Cricut project. So we are going to explore these close to my heart SVG collections, digital art collections, and I'm looking for my Cherish collection. And right here I have this two page double layout and this seems to be what's giving some of you problems. And it's a really easy fix, but it just stumps you for a moment and I wanted to show you what to do. So I've gone to uploads, I've clicked on this two page layout and I am going to just try to make it fit here on the screen by sizing the screen down to 50% so we can look at all of it. Now, what gives us the problem is the fact that we have two 12, 12 by 12 base pages here. They're represented in that beautiful blue background color. Now, we're not actually going to ever cut that on our Cricut. Cricut can only cut to 11 and a half by 11 and a half. So these are here just for show, but a lot of people don't realize that is what is causing this error when you go to the make it button. So I'm just going to close out of here and there's two ways to handle this. We're going to go down to our layers panel and I'm going to actually look for that little eye and that tells me that I have a problem there. Now I specifically know that it is those background pages. So I'm looking for that big background page right there. When I click on it, it's going to highlight just the background and I can do one of two things. I'm actually going to choose to get rid of this by hitting that little eyeball and hiding that background page. Now on this side, I'm going to search for it in layers once again, but what I'm going to do once I select it is that I'm going to show you that you can actually hit the delete button as well. You can use either of those two ways to remove that image from you know, getting into the cutting queue, so to speak. And so by doing so now, I can go over to the make it button and you're going to see that we now no longer get that project incompatible and it's going to allow us to cut our project. So it's a really simple fix, just hide or delete those big base pages. But I know it's just one of those things that until you do it a few times, it just doesn't, it seems like it's probably a bigger issue than it is. And so it's a simple fix. And I hope that this little video helped you. And if you have any more questions, be sure to put them down below in this video's description. And if you've not yet done so, please consider becoming one of my subscribers so you don't miss any of my future tips or projects. Thanks for watching and have a creative day.